Hi, welcome to Coastal Update, presented to you by the brokers and agents at Remax of Gulf Shores. We're going to deviate today from our normal report because these are certainly not normal times we're experiencing. First, our thought and prayers go out that you and your family are staying safe and staying home. We see progress going in that regard and we're glad to see it. Um, the real estate market, lots of calls lately. What's happening with the real estate market as it relates to this current pandemic that's going on? It's just too early to tell right now. That's why these updates are gonna be continually very important as we go through it. April's gonna be a very telltale month. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna cover the first three months of 2020, and we'll be back to you next month, or even sooner if we need to, if we see a drastic change in the market. But right now, everybody's experiencing a new normal. We're doing closings electronically. We're doing showings virtually. Uh, we're doing a lot of things differently than we did so that we can stay safe. Here at our office, we've sent all our staff home to work remotely and agents uh, are operating their business plan as they best see fit to serve their clients. So with that said, please stay safe, please stay home, and let's get into the market. This is our Pleasure Island condominium market for the areas of Gulf Shores, Orange Beach, Fort Morgan, and Perdido Key. We've gathered all the data from the Baldwin Realtors database, so let's take a look at the numbers. As you can see here, inventory is down just slightly from last year, but look at the big jump we experienced from March 1st to April 1st. Those are all the condominiums that came on the market. We were under 600 just a month ago, and now we're north of 725. So we did see a lot of units come on the market, which is a tad unusual. This shows the number of condominiums that sold in the month of March at 147, down from the same time last year. As I said, April's really gonna be a key factor, which we'll be reporting on soon. Total number of units sold was up 1% to 364. The average sales price actually down to $404,000, a 5% decrease from the same time last year. Median price, as you know, we like to focus on because that means half the sales were above and half were below, exactly where we were after the first quarter of 2019 at $375,000. Average dollars per square foot up a couple percent to 310. Next, look at the units that we gauge demand with, which is contingent on sale or pending. And on April 1st, that stood at 138 units. That's down 25%. That's the units that we can expect to see close over the next 30 to 60 days. If you're thinking about buying or selling here along the beautiful Alabama Gulf Coast, contact your local market experts on the Kevin Corcoran team at Remax of Gulf Shores so that they can help you with that decision. We make it our job to stay on top of the market so you can make the most informed decision possible. We hope you found this video informative and we look forward to hearing from you. Tune in next month for another Coastal Update. Thanks for watching and have a great day.